Hello Year 2 and welcome back to your online learning. We are going to be continuing with our reading skills now, which we started yesterday. So we are going to get straight into it. Okay, just a reminder then, uh, just this week, we're going to be just doing some comprehension activities, just so that we can practice our different reading skills that we have been practicing, we've been doing in school. Um, before we do that, just have a little think to yourself about what those different reading skills are that we use. If you want to pause the video, you can, sit, you can do, just see if you can remember what they all are. Right, let's go through them then. So that first one that we use quite a lot is our retrieval skills. So retrieval is when something is in the text and we're just picking it straight out. Inference, slightly more tricky. That's when we're using past knowledge. That's when we're looking for clues in the text. That's when we're reading between the lines. Prediction is when we're having a sensible guess about something that's going to be happening next. Explaining is when we are explaining why we're happen uh, why something's happening or explain what's happened. Vocabulary is when we are looking at the different word types and their meanings. And then also sequencing as well when we are putting things into order. So let's see which of those skills we are going to be using today. So this is the same text that we started uh, yesterday. So this is now the next piece of the text. And just to remind you, we had um, the start of our story where we had a little girl called Jasmine and she had an older brother called JJ and their mum was away working. So they were doing different bits and bobs. And on the Friday, they decided that they were going to do something nice for their mum, didn't they? And they thought it'd be a good idea to paint the fence out in the garden. So this is the next piece of our text. What I'm going to ask you to do is pause the screen now and have a go at reading that yourself. OK, let's go through that together. You can read along with me. When we finished, our painting was really bright and colourful. Then JJ said, hold these brushes very carefully. I will get something to clean them. I wanted to see the top of our picture. So I climbed the steps. They wobbled. I dropped the brushes. So our first set of questions then are, why did Jasmine climb the steps? Let's have a little think, why did Jasmine climb the steps? And secondly, why did Jasmine drop the brushes? Was it because the steps moved? Was it because the brushes were dirty? Was it because JJ told her to? Or was it because mum was angry? So if you can't quite remember, do feel free to rewind the video and have another little read of that text. And we will go through the answers for those in a moment. Okay, the next part. Again, pause the video, have a go at reading it yourself first. Okay, let's go through that together. Read it with me. Red, white, green and yellow droplets flicked all over the sky at the top of our lovely painting. Great splashes of paint landed on my clothes. Mum will be furious, I wailed. We rubbed and scrubbed as much as we could. We did not hear Mum come home. Then. We saw her. I wanted to hide from her really cross face. Question number seven then. What happened when Jasmine dropped the brushes? So what was it that happened? Have a think about it. Question number eight. Find and copy two words that tell you how JJ and Jasmine tried to clean off the paint. So for that one, it is find and copy. So you don't have to make up the words. You do have to just retrieve those straight from the text. So again, have another little read over it if you need to. Pause the video now and have a look at these questions and try to answer them. Okay, let's have a 
look at those answers together. So question number five asked us, why did Jasmine climb the steps? So there's a few things that you could have put down for this one. The first option you could have put was that she, um, so that she could look at the top of the picture um, to see the top of the shed or because she wanted to see the top of the painting. And we know that because in the text, it said, I wanted to see the top of our picture, so I climbed the steps. They wobbled and I dropped the brushes. OK, so we can retrieve that one straight from the text. Then our question number eight, oh, sorry, question number six said, why did Jasmine drop the brushes? So hopefully for that one, you ticked that the steps moved because the text did say that they wobbled. So well done if you got that one right. Question number seven was what happened when Jasmine dropped the brushes? So you um, could have put the paint went everywhere. You might have put um, the brushes fell and then Jasmine was covered in paint. You might have put the paint crushed down. OK, there's a few different things you could have put for that. Hopefully you got that one right. And then finally, it said find and copy two words that tell you how JJ and Jasmine tried to clean off the paint. So let's just look back at the text. Mum will be furious, I wailed. We rubbed and scrubbed as much as we could. Okay, so for that one, we should have put rubbed and scrubbed. So hopefully you got those uh, questions correct. That's all for today then guys. So tomorrow in Friday's Reading Skills, we're going to be looking at the final part of this story and just answering a couple more questions. So well done today if you got those right and I will see you tomorrow. Thanks everyone.